In the first generations of wireless networks, carriers acquired land and built antenna towers to reach all the mobile phones that we use today. Now, with 5G and high-frequency cellular, TVs, computers, and all internet devices can run on wireless. The problem is these high frequencies. Existing towers don't have the range nor the capacity to cover all of our devices. To solve this problem, we introduce the owner-operated radio model. It looks something like this. Meet Jane. As an example, she owns a home and she has access to gigabit speed internet. Now Jane agrees to install and operate a gateway small cell radio for the carrier. For this, Jane is paid by the carrier as she operates that small cell. Now in another example, meet John. John does not have access to gigabit speed internet. So John installs a repeater small cell and it transfers data via wireless to that gateway radio. Now John is also paid by the carrier, but less than Jane because she is a gateway operator. A carrier can expand this model, adding more owners to operate wireless radios until ideal coverage is reached. A cell sector is configured with a limited number of owners, which is access points. So increasing owners increases coverage. And a cell sector has a maximum value that is paid to owners. Increasing this value increases owner participation until there is an ideal combination of cost and coverage. It's a new way to network.